I want to make you understand something that Satan has a lot to do with the leadership of this world right now. And we as God's children must be wise to understand these things. Revelation chapter 12, 7 to 9 says, And there was war in heaven. Michael and his angels fought against the dragon. And the dragon fought against his angels, and he prevailed not. Neither was there was their place found anymore in heaven. And the great dragon was cast out. That old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceived the whole world, he was cast out into the earth, and his angels were cast out with him. This is Bible. So we are told in Revelation chapter 12 that Satan was in heaven. And because of his pride, he was cast out. And he used his tail to wipe one third of the stars of heaven. This one third of the stars of heaven represents the one third of the whole angels of God in heaven. He was able to deceive one out of every three. The kingdom of God was divided. And from that moment, a kingdom emanated out of God's kingdom. And that kingdom is a kingdom of darkness. So from that time, there has been these two kingdoms that have been existing in heaven and on earth. In Genesis chapter 1 verse 26 to 28, God created man in his own image and handed over this planet to man. He also created two trees. He created the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. And he also created the tree of life. And these two trees were in the middle of the garden, the garden of Eden. The tree of the knowledge of good and evil is a symbol of the existence of good and evil. Existence of God, good, and the existence of Satan the devil, evil. And that tree is forbidden. That tree of the knowledge of good and evil is a symbol of the presence of the evil one on earth. What brought about the destruction of the world that existed, that left a foundation, left darkness, and left water on the deep? What brought about that destruction? I believe the world that existed before this Adamic world was destroyed when Satan and his fallen angels were driven down from heaven. This is what I believe. And God had to create a tree and call it the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. Don't touch it. If you touch it, you are going to die. You are like me. You don't die. But the day you eat of it, you shall surely die. But those who die don't belong to the kingdom of God. Because with God is eternity. There's nothing like death. But with the devil, there is death. If you eat the tree of the knowledge of good and evil, you shall surely die. And in Genesis chapter 3, the devil came and deceived the woman. And the woman deceived the man. And they both ate of that tree. And they were driven out. And from that moment, there was the transfer of authority. The authorities that was dedicated to Adam and Eve, they lost it. 